pressure here. We need to stop the bleeding. It seems I've lost a step in my old age, eh, Dekata? No. Hey, <coughs> you made it. Did you kill that sorcerer fellow? Don't talk. The storm has broken. We'll get you out of here. Oh, it's a shame. <coughs> I got mine. Just a hair too late. Sneaky devil poked me in the back. <sighs> Skewered like a quill rat. So it goes. Hey, dear God. Aye. So it goes. They'll be coming. I'm taking the sightless eye. We need a safe place to study it. Use it against them. We'll meet at the desert chapel. Go. In fact, trouble is, he won't stay dead. Hmm. He is more powerful than I thought. I underestimated him. So did I. But we took something important from him, at least. The sightless eye. I think he was using it to commune with Lilith from afar. A powerful piece of magic. And dangerous. Perhaps we can use it to our advantage. Give me some time to study it. The prime evils were reforming. Hell was coming. But Elias was not the answer to anyone's prayers. If you want to take the measure of someone, you judge them by their deeds, not their words. Simple as that. Elias preached of saving the world while standing atop a mountain of corpses. Then there was the Wanderer. Everything Elias was not. Tainted by Lilith's blood, and yet able to resist her corruption. That was what I witnessed in the Wanderer's deeds. And that was when I started to think that perhaps together, we could keep the evil at bay. It must have been gruesome in that cult of his. No more gruesome than the rest of sanctuaries underbelly.